The two-day mangrove forum aims to build local and regional capacity in mangrove restoration and management while raising awareness of the values of mangroves. It also brings together national, regional and international researchers and mangrove managers to share experiences and knowledge of the sustainable management of mangrove ecosystems. Addressing the gathering, Agriculture Minister Dr. Leslie Ramsamy noted the critical importance of mangrove restoration. He said over 500,000 mangrove seedlings have been planted countrywide as efforts intensify to protect the shorelines from environmental degradation. We have to do a much better job in educating our people about the mangrove. While some of us seem to now know that mangroves are an important part of our defense against an encroaching sea, against rising seawater, ones that welcome ambassador to his new homes, to his new home. Not every citizen sees mangrove as a good thing or as a necessary thing. Minister Ramsam explained that Guyana continues to do its best to mitigate the impact of rising sea levels. That shore zone management is a permanent program in the Guyana government's stewardship of our country. We see it as important in our economic and social development we see it as an imperative in developing our country, in ensuring that our people are safe, in ensuring that the shore zone itself is a part of the economic and social life of our country. The Agriculture Minister said government will continue its investments in the mangrove restoration project with some $268 million earmarked in this regard. Also addressing the gathering were Chief Executive Officer of NARI, Dr. Udo Homnoth, Chairperson of the Mangrove Action Committee, Annette Arjun, and Head of Delegation of the European Union, Ambassador Robert Kopecki. The theme for the two-day forum is restoring and managing mangrove ecosystems in a changing world. For the NCN News, Shanza Samuels.